Hello everybody, my name is Kala Siriki and in this video I'm going to teach you how to change the splash screen on a Garmin ERA 500 GPS. This is an aviation GPS. Now this is a problem or I should say a question that someone asked. So this is specifically this video is made for them so they can learn how to do it. Now there is one thing you need to realize that in order to switch it you have to switch from aviation mode to car mode. So watch the video. Here's how you do it. So this is your GPS, you turn it on. Uh, currently, it's in aviation mode. In aviation mode, it doesn't even show the splash screen. The sp splash screen doesn't even have a chance to appear. Just the Garmin logo appears. However, if I wanna change the splash screen for car mode, I go to tools. I go to automotive. Yes. I wait for it. I already put an airplane there. So watch the airplane. As soon as the Garmin, there you go. The Boeing 747 is what I put. Now it's a shame that this only comes, uh, let me increase the volume. I mean the brightness so it doesn't settings display. 50 Which would you like? sense okay you have to, the screen has to be at 100 percent so it doesn't flicker okay now i go to settings scroll down picture viewer choose whichever picture i want to set as splash screen but i'm gonna choose the airplane click on info and check that box use this photo as default splash screen so that box has to be checked back back and back you can hold back and it will go automatically to the main screen you don't have to press it 10 times just hold it so now i'm going to turn this off when i turn it off i turn it back on this the initial startup is garmin logo as soon as this is done the splash screen comes in which is that airplane which i have chosen Unfortunately, this only works for car mode and uh, aviation mode. It doesn't even reach the splash screen. It, it loads all the interfaces for aviation. Okay, so now I'm going to switch back to aviation mode. And watch, it will reload, but there will be no splash screen. The, the Garmin logo is the default operating system screen. This is where the splash screen is supposed to kick in, but it doesn't even reach that point and it goes straight to the main menu for, you know, aviation. Okay, now the question is, how do we transfer images to the Garmin, like the airplane image that I had there? In order to do that, you have to hook it up to your PC and you have to resize the image to, let me show you you cannot put any image in there again the size is 480 by 270 and that's the image and now I'm going to show you uh, the, the GPS uh, in order to plug it in a lot of people plug in their GPS's to the computer using this you can't do that you cannot plug it in from here to the to the computer to plug this in uh, to the computer to access it, you have to open the battery door and use this USB port inside. So that's what you need to plug it in. USB port inside. Uh, this is where you plug in your GPS to your computer. Not from the cradle. Not from here. So yeah, that's this is for like uh, car uh, cigarette lighter or traffic receiver and that kind of stuff uh, traffic condition status update and whatnot and then you drag and drop this inside your GPS uh, a JPEG folder when you plug in the GPS you shall you need to put it in the JPEG folder so yeah that's what it is okay thank you for watching please make sure to like and subscribe